Yo, what is good, everybody? Welcome back. Hopefully, you guys are having an awesome day with only positive vibes. Guys, it is Thursday, so that means there's going to be a brand new event as well as a new lucky draw. So let's go ahead and hop into the game and check it out. All right, we are in the game. There is going to be a new lucky draw as well as the event, but I don't think, personally speaking, I will go too ham on the lucky draw just because it is going to be the MK2. However, we can take a look at it, see how it looks. This one looks really nice. We're going to skip it because I've already seen this. However, let's take a look at some of the cool things we have access to. We have the new Rosa skin. A lot of people will be interested in this one, which is pretty sick. We have a ASM-10 Volution. Vo Volution? Like solution, but V? That's kind of nice. We have the emote. Hard day work. That's kind of cool. I kind of like that. Trip mine. Noah's going to love that. We have the Karambit. We also have a sick backpack, honestly. And we have the target practice. That's really nice and clean. We got the banner. We have the motorcycle. And we have the MK2 Helix. I probably will do a couple pulls. But that's, it looks sick. I'm not, I'm not going to act like it doesn't look sick. It looks really, really nice. And the effect is kind of cool. But honestly, I'm not really too keen of it. So let's just do like I re recommend. Usually, if you don't have the money to spend for this, don't buy it. But if you're willing to spend a little bit, do at least two, three pulls. Because it costs nothing. It's like 30 pulls for the first few one. And you might get lucky and get the character. I actually got really lucky the other day and pulled the character on the first pull. But despite that, you honestly don't need to be uh, super lucky. But we got the trip mine. And the cost is not that great. Obviously, yes, I say it's not that great. You still have to have some money. If you don't have any money, it's definitely not worth it to pull. But we'll see. We did get the backpack. I will do four or five because I think that's a fair amount. Especially if, you know, it's only coming down to around six, seven hundred total. And if you get lucky, you get something cool. We got the motorcycle. And that's actually pretty nice and clean. And some draws are better than the other one because this one doesn't have a parachute. This one doesn't have a wingsuit. And most of the stuff are pretty worthwhile. So when you see draws like these, it's actually pretty cool. And if you get the character skin, you're pretty much a golden. And I got the... Um uh, what's it called? The charm. And I actually love having charms. But despite that, uh, we're not going to do any more polls because I don't think it's worth it. But I think the main thing is going to be the event. But we'll check the store to see if there's anything else that's new. There was the new credit shop. We have, she looks like we have a uh, Arctic skin. I don't know if this is here before, but Sprite Ops looks kind of cool. We also have the dead end thing. Other than that, motorcycle skin. I think that was already there before. Everything else seems to be pretty old. Nothing too crazy. You guys will let me know if there is. There also is right now the... Um, World Championship Qualifier, which I haven't done yet, but we'll probably will. So, High Noon Chase. Let's take a look at this. My first impressions, same thing. You will be able to get a free Tango skin. I love these Tango skins. Super nice and clean. However, the voices are really, really bad usually from this. So, not a huge fan of that. And also, is this going to be an Echo? Wow, we're getting an Echo Shotgun. One of the underwhelming shotguns, but I might want to make a video on this. If I had to guess, this is going to be similar to like the other event that we ever had. However... You can actually get extra points. Let me see. Let me read this real quick. Uh, play MPBR to get share stars. The longer you play, the more you get. You know, 1v1 duels as well. Spend your star to get your heroes. All right, let's view the map. I think that's the important part. No escape. Doesn't matter. All right, you start off with points. And you can use your points to claim stuff to move. So it's very similar to a board game. And I'm guessing you just get points to unlock these things. So that's actually pretty cool. And you'll get points based on uh, a few things. Like the game, how long you play. More likely if you play Domination on like a long, uh, I ran the map, Nuketown. It'll last a little longer. Uh, if you play Standoff, you know, stuff like that. Or even just playing Hardpoint on the shipment could still be worthwhile if you get a lot of kills. But you can see as you get more and more points, you will unlock cool stuff. Uh, motorcycle, Outlaw skins, PDW, nothing crazy that I see yet. We get an Arctic skin, HSO skin, DRH, and once you get to the end, I'm guessing when you unlock everything, so everything will progress. So you'll you'll see how much points, it doesn't say how much points you need right now, but I'm assuming as you progress, you'll be able to get a lot more points. So overall, nothing too crazy, but should be noted that you can get a lot of points just from playing. So that's kind of cool. We'll just double check how do you get stars. You just play games, right? And you get sheriff stars. So nothing crazy, but again, you get some free skins, which is nothing to be too sad about. I wish it would have been like a BY15 skin or HSO or anything different, but the Echo is a nice and clean one. We'll definitely be trying to get it. Uh, we're going to be playing a lot of the games. We're checking if there's anything else that's new. We check the featured. Doesn't. Ooh, you get a free banner that's kind of cool that might have been there before i just didn't notice it you can get a asm 10 skin i think that was already there we got the comic and nothing new in the seasonal so other than that i don't think i missed anything um if we go to like multiplayer there might be a new event that you guys can actually play 
but besides that i don't think there's anything new you can play the um, 1v1 duos i think you'll get a lot more points from that but overall nothing too crazy i mean it's nice you can actually get the free character from the thing but i think that's really the only cool thing i wish it would tell you how many points you need it doesn't really but i guess uh, once we unlock it we'll do some gameplay with that all right that's it for today hopefully you guys enjoyed the video if you did like share and subscribe let me know in the comments down below what you guys think about this event honestly it's nothing too crazy but then again it is free the fact you get a free tango skin is actually really nice but the gun skin itself is not that great i wish it had been something more usable since the echo is not really meta at all but let me know what you guys think all right i'll see you guys next time kill it